Ross gonna have to commit to the board here. It's gonna be Heritage Root, Nettle Sentinel, Nettle Sentinel. We may see a combo turn coming up here. Cast Elvish Visionary, floating one green. That untapped both his Nettle Sentinel draws a card. He's going to go for Green Sun Zenith. Got a copy of Wirewood Symbiote. Bounce with Visionary, untapped Heritage Root. That gets him to five green. Two of the five to cast Elvish Visionary again. Draws a card. Three green floating. And his fetch was for Dryad Arbor right now. So Ross is really, he's committing to the board very hard oh, yeah. right now. It's going to be Green Sun Zenith once again. The crazy part about this hand is this started off nothing. Off yes. three lands. And this has all been one turn. Gets another copy of Wirewood Symbiote. And this really just does insulate himself against a sweeper. He can pick up almost his whole team if Reed sweeps this board. Bounce the Visionary again. Recast Elvish Visionary. Another time that puts him, would put him down to four mana. He tapped three up to seven. Is now down to five green. Taps again. This is going to be Query on Ranger. And he has a ton of green, making putting the whole board into play with multiple Query on Rangers. And it's going to end with a natural order. So playing the entire hand right now. This is going to be a very big crater hook. Well, I mean, we're doing a price check on the number of creatures to play. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Leaving the Planeswalker alone, he's going to put Reed down to, oh, it's one. Ross was just one creature short of making it lethal. <laughs> the first and last mistake you made was to underestimate the power of a Saiyan warrior. While so many others grow weaker during battle, we Saiyans become stronger. You can bleed us to the brink of death, crush every bone in our bodies, it only makes us more powerful. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!